I like to tell people, because it's true, that there is a secret to being an astronaut. And the secret is, is that nobody just gets to be an astronaut. Katie Coleman is one of 54 women in history to have flown in space. She's crewed on the International Space Station twice, but today she takes on a new mission at the Burton Bar Library in Phoenix. I am here to recruit new astronauts and new folks to help us with the space program in the future. Those new recruits happen to be students from elementary schools around the valley. Coleman stresses to students and parents that math and science skills are crucial to a successful career as an astronaut. I'm hoping it makes them realize that there's a lot of cool stuff to do and that they have to be ready. And getting ready starts at places like the library. But what Coleman doesn't mention is the other place that helped her get ready, the band room. I've played the flute since I was in sixth grade, and I'm an average flute player. I just like to play. I was never first chair in high school or any of those things. For the 50th anniversary of Russian Yuri Gagarin's first flight into space in 1961, Coleman played a flute duet with Ian Anderson of the rock band Jethro Tull. But it wasn't your typical duet. The two played at the same time, but while Anderson was on the ground in Russia, Coleman played from the space station. I thought it was important to find a way to play with people who were on the Earth. But Coleman also admits that if it weren't for certain people in her life, she would not be where she is today. Individual people that made really key differences to me along the way to keep me thinking that it was, I could do something like this. For No 99, I'm Pierce Bly.